Welcome back to Summer Bash 2012. Well, as you can see, I'm in my room right now, and you may be wondering what I'm doing here. Well, to explain this, you see that box? Yes, all those boxes right over there. I brought those for college. It has books, notebooks, music stuff, you know, all the wonderful stuff. And inside the box, I found out I had a lot of Coldplay stuff, surprisingly, just which sort of scared me in a good way. So, I'll show you what I have in my Coldplay collection because I have very interesting things that I didn't realize. Let's see here, I found this. I found a copy of Viva La Vida that I, oh sorry, that I wrote for two violins and two cellos. Oh, excuse me, that I wrote for college for freshman year. It's only one page sadly, you know, it's not enough. It's still a work in progress. I wrote Paradise for a string quartet. You see, violin, viola, oh sorry, violin, violin 2, viola, and violin cello, which is really fun to write. It's still a work in progress, but, you know, I'm going to finish one, I'll finish these one day. Um, I have a xylo band right over here from August 3rd, 2012. As you can see, it's glowing. Yeah, all you just gotta is take a little bobby pin and just stick it right inside there. And if you've never been to a Coldplay concert, please go to one. You will not regret it at all. Oh yes, and on Tumblr right now, I'm giving away Brothers and Sisters, the EP, released in March 1999. Wow, well, that's quite a long time ago. And it says it's 1999. It was also recorded by Fierce Panda or something like that. So basically only 2,500 copies were released throughout worldwide in 1999. Nothing a lot. And many of you have been wondering, what does it look like, you know? This is what the inside looks like, you know? It has three songs listed right over here. And don't worry, the CD's in really good copy. I checked it out, so it's all set to go. And I'll be giving it on September. I'll be announcing the winner on September 4th. 2012 a.m. No, 2012. 12 a.m. I am so sorry. <laughs> um, let's see here. I have Parachutes right over here. Great album. Um, I have a rush of blood to the head, which is used. Sadly, the person who decided to sell this at FYE did not take good care of this, and I am superiorly upset at them. This is why you need to take care of CDs carefully, and this is why I do not trust doors selling CDs because I was going through I was going through a lot of you know tags today and on the brothers and sisters giveaway or the Coldplay giveaway thing oh actually it's called giveaway to Coldplay errors yeah it's really cheesy but a lot of a lot of you guys said like how come you guys don't why didn't you sell on a store this is the reason why it has scratches dents Yes, and if you take care, good, good care of a CD, comes like this, you know. And here's X and Y, used, one of my favorite albums, and whoever took good care of this, I love you. Right now, I don't even know who you are, but I love you right now. <laughs> Viva La Vida or Destin All Friends, love it. And it's all a funny story here, it's actually one of the first albums I've listened to in my life, so this is how I actually got hooked up on Coldplay. <laughs> and this is the Viva La Vida Prospects March. Yeah, I actually have both of them inside. You see? Viva La Vida and Prospects March. Sweet deal. Well, this is the EP, that's the album, so, you know, what else can go wrong? And I have Milo Zalato. Milo Zalato? Milo... I don't know how you people pronounce it. <laughs> And I actually do have the vinyl right over here. Pretty sick, isn't it? I just absolutely adore it. Yes. And this poster, you may be wondering why am I holding it up. If you look carefully, it says Coldplay Viva La Vida, the new album available June 17th, 2008. Yeah, you probably can't read it, but I can read it from here. Yeah, and this is my Coldplay collection that I have right now. I do have White Shadows, 
which I threw it out. It was a string quartet version, and I threw it out, and I greatly regret that. Um, I do have Kohli Chibis, and and I did have a painting of Chris Martin, which turned out really horrendous, and I am so sorry, Chris Martin, in the bottom of my heart. Like, I am so sorry <laughs> to say this, but I just couldn't bear with it because it looked so awful that I had to throw it out. And... Yeah, I think that's all I have, actually. And I do have... And hopefully I'll buy more Coldplay merch, and... Yes, I am working on a Coldplay a composition slash string quartet arrangement for violin, viola, cello, and possibly double bass, and... Well, piano too, and a few other instruments. And yes, the few other instruments are household instruments, like legitimately like glasses of water. Yes, it will call glasses of water. Yes, it will say there. So I'm trying to write rainy day, um, Christmas lights, and probably a few more out there just for fun. I don't know how long this project will take, but I'm just gonna write it write it out for fun, you know. Possibly give it away too sometime in the future. If you guys are interested, you could also leave a comment down below, and let's see here. And just please suggest a few songs. I don't care if it's a B-side, album, EP, go ahead, comment. <laughs> and this, I will be shipping it to my lucky winner who gets it on September, once it, you know, once it's done on September 4th, 2012 at 12 a.m. And if you want Tumblr, yeah, I'll send a, I'll put the link down on, uh, down below, and I'll put it on Tumblr. Actually, no, sorry, you just have to block it once, or, and or like it, you know, it's up to you. Yep, this is the EP, having copy, and my iPod's playing every cheer up is a waterfall, which is phenomenal. <laughs> So yeah, that's all I have, and I will see you guys later. Bye!